Now he's got it. The kick out. Mitchell. Three not there. Rosario with the rebound. Here's Njai. Able to get it to go. Could have passed it to Mitchell. And Hill during the halftime speech said, look, guys, we have to go inside to Njai. He has no points or not even any touches down on the block. That has to be rectified. You need balance on your offensive scheme. They heard you. And the right hand. What a hook shot. 49%. Mitchell. Njai keeps it alive, puts it up, and he's fouled. And he'll... No. Happens. And Gilbert Brown's going to sit down for a while. He is, uh, along with Trayvon Woodall, as uh, Dixon checks back into the game as well as Wanamaker for the Panthers. And Rosario desperately looking for something and almost threw that pass away. Now, Jermaine Dixon, such a good one on one defender. His job is to stop Mike Rosario this afternoon. Rosario had 22 last year when the Panthers nearly upset. Or were nearly upset as uh, Enjai hits that shot. We're nearly upset down. Robinson with the miss. Here's Rosario. Thought about the three. Gets past Hazel. Finds Enjai. Look at that right from the right First bucket, Eugene Harvey. No sign of a bruised right hand on that bucket. He comes in averaging eight. Rosario. Enjai. It's rejected. Last touch by Seton Hall. You know. The rebound goes to Dane Miller. Kicks it out to Colbert. Nice pass to Enjai. And, that's and you don't have to. By anyone, he now has 11. Colbert looking to answer high off the glass. Enjai there. Got to go up. Wow, what a putback by H. Even if you can't. As far as instituting your will and dictating the tempo, Rutgers is taking advantage of that. Rutgers has yet to miss a shot here to start the half. Nice pass. Beatty going off to Enjai, and he has it stripped. The Mountaineers go back to that very tall lineup, except for Missoula. Njai puts it up and has it blocked. Beautifully done that time by Ebanks. He'll bring it up himself. Second time we've seen Butler put the ball on the floor and go left. He's a right-handed player, but showing he can go right or left and, and looking comfortable doing it. Nice pass. I think a lot of fans looked at Jimmy Butler for Cashmere Wright, the redshirt freshman out of Savannah, Georgia, the first Cincinnati field goal in more than six minutes. You know, split the middle of that zone and made the big guy come up. And Jai the miss. Takes it down the one time, Mr. Basketball in the state of Virginia. And they pick up right where they left off. Nice job by Monroe. You know, he demands so much attention down low. They committed two defenders to him. Fluffing off on Vaughn and Morell passes right out of it for another assist. How about Enjai, huh? Back in St. John's chipping away at the free throw line, but not getting it done on the defensive end right now. Beatty gets a high screen from Enjai. Mitchell pops out. Staying with the high pick and roll. Mismatch there for Enjai, but he can't hit. Mason gets the relief on this team. Just yet. By the way, Robinson at the other end extended his game streak. Of you know, Fred, one of those throwback guys, kind of an old school coach where you not only play athletics, play college basketball for him, but community service, academic performance, all very important in the Fred Hill program. And we've not seen this lineup too much as Missoula and Bryant are in there at the same time. Flowers travels. Short rebound form. Cincinnati is a very good defensive squad. Last game they held UConn to 40% shooting. The fourth game in a row they've held a team under 40%. Vaughn dumps it down to McLean. He goes right to Enjai, way off Jackson the rebound. Enjai trying to attack the middle of that zone. Routens, he's got two threes already. Johnson. A little push from behind. Missed opportunity for the Scarlet Knights there. 
29-14. Yeah, this Rutgers team. Look at the Syracuse game a couple of weeks ago. They trailed by 24. They chipped it down to nine. And against Villanova, they're down 32. Got it down to 16. They won't stop fighting. You hate to see a young team uh, fall into too deep of a hole. And Jai with the rejection. That's his second today. Mitchell, the Florida transfer, the one-time New York player of the year, has got six points. The lefty, he can step out. Averaging 13.6 boards in Big E's play. You can see why. Quick trigger. Fred Hill telling us uh, that Mitchell and Njai can do all they can. Trying to make up that void from uh, left by Echenique. Clark gets an air ball, and it's picked up by Njai. Beatty picks up right. Good job to stay away by Beatty. You don't want to foul him running across half court. Not going to do any damage there. Monroe backs down Njai. Monroe going right at him. Georgetown has the lead. They want to go to their strengths. They know where it is. Terrific move. Ten on the shot clock now for Hayward. Oh. Hayward. Good body hang. Doesn't go down. Rebound Butler. Brand new 35. Second quarter. Oh, See it though. Injai doesn't get the, the block shot, but he altered that shot from Hayward just with his mere presence. You mentioned rebounding. Marquette comes in plus three on the glass. Scarlet Knights minus four. Butler off the dribble with a left hand and one. Maybe if too far away from the basket where he can be effective. Rutgers has got to learn that fine art of feeding the post. Tough shot by Torrey Jackson. And, and don't they also have to do that oh, by Rosario coming down the middle of the floor? He's yeah. got 10. Yeah, a better decision too, Scott, in terms of going to the basket with it rather than settling. That's a great job of creating yeah. space by Edwards. Yeah, you know. It's no more about the, the DePaul job that it's not something that would be something that another coach would want, but you're looking in the top media market and, you know, largest Catholic institution, so I think they got a lot of offer, and then you know, it's going to be exciting when they get whoever's going to come in. What an athletic move on the baseline. Get it to go, Warner, with yet another rebound. He's had a big night on the glass. Rogers going to work the clock now. Werner will try inside, takes an extra step, turnover. I expect to head down to Tim Chant going. I would expect a chance we'll see him here. And coaches here, trust me. Yeah. Been there, done that. And usually I get that guy in sooner rather than later in this type of a game. Well, it's the Oakland Zoo. We want Tim Fry here yeah, now. I want Tim Fry. <laughs> Out of the blocks to McGee, trying to go to work on Njai. Njai got a piece and batted it to Cobra. With a credit. Coming up big. That was one of the big factors of why they were struggling. Now he's back to help this team. All right, here we go. DePaul basketball. Boswell has it against Injun and a foul on the floor. They need shots quickly, though, now. Three possession ball game. Comes out to Gibbs. Has to chase it down. Loses some time there. Correa down the line. Back in the lineup. Has it rejected by Njai. Three is up and short for Gurley. Down to eight seconds to go. Beatty gets Notre Dame with a chance to cut into the six-point lead nearing the five-minute uh, five mark here in the second half. But Freddie Hill was not happy with that call. A strip as Herringote tried to go up again. 